Hey everybody, welcome to this week's episode recap of America's Next Top Model, season 12. It's the premiere. Yes. And, and it's in Vegas. That's right, because Tyra loves Vegas. They have all you could eat. She loves that. So, thousands have applied this season. They uh, got it down to 34. It's eventually going to get down to the final 13. All right, so. Let's see, begin. This year is goddesses. Yeah, and the Jays were waiting for the girls outside of Caesar's Palace when they arrived in their bus. And uh, it was so corny. They made them put on these goddess outfits with, like, the sandals that came up to the knee. It was just really bad, like, really bad cocktail waitress outfits. <laughs> so then they did a photo shoot. In profile. Right. <clears throat> and then they walked the runway for Miss J. Yeah. And uh, some were better than others, but most were crap. There's some potential there, though. There, yeah. Not a whole lot of memorable girls this season, I don't think. Nobody really struck me right off the bat as, like, wow, that person's got it. And then Tyra was all, I'm the goddess of fierce. Yeah. I need to retire and pass the baton. You just whatever. need to retire. You're the goddess of corn. <laughs> so, immediately, there's some strong personalities in the group. Angel Angelia. Angelia. Angelia, okay. And uh, Sandra. Rivalry. Sandra is, like, from Africa, and she doesn't take any shiz from anyone, and she does what she wants when yeah. she wants to do it. So, yeah, there was a whole lot of hand in the face and, you know, like, shh. Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> what I was up see with that? I on the forehead, though. No. Good, because there probably would have been some bloodshed. <coughs> so, they go to the individual judging before the judges panel, which is basically uh, Tyra. What's your name? Yeah. Show us yourself. Tyra and the two J's, right? So, we find out that there's a Bible thumper. Um, a burn survivor. A pen collector. <laughs> An epileptic. A prom queen. A black skin. That was kind of cool, actually. I think um, she's got a really good look. Yeah. Somebody who's really poor who slept in the Port Authority in New York City because she couldn't afford a room when she went for the uh, interview. Yeah. That was kind of sad. Yeah. Um, a plus size model. And a bug eyed blood lover. <laughs> Alright, my friend was telling me about this clip today because mm -hmm. in band I had a massive bloody nose. <laughs> and I got to the bathroom, it was okay, nothing got on me. Verdell is really freaked out right now, I so. Know. But I don't, how did she see the clip before the show was They on? must have had some spoilers <laughs> online. You're too good, Julia. You're yeah. Too good. <laughs> So, it's time to make the first cut. We're going to 21, because that's Blackjack. Yep, so then they had a photo shoot with Mr. J. Yeah, and he had some cards with, like, qualities on it. Like, and goddess of love, goddess of right. friendship. They had to portray that quality, you know, like, proud or love, like Maddie said. Yeah, and stuff yeah. Like that. pretty nondescript. And, uh, yeah, they cut down... The 21, based on that photo shoot, to the 13. And the final 13 are... Who will be living in the house. Right, in, in New York City. That's the right. The Upper East Side. The fashion capital of the entire world, world, world. So, Amina. It's Amina. Amina. <laughs> <laughs> Natalie. Fo. Allison. Is, is her first name Mo? No. Um... Talia. It's like Felicia. Talia. Talia. Does anybody have a normal name this season we besides just, like Allison? This is a new world we're living in. <sighs> okay. Um, yes, everyone's special and different, yes. Did you get Celia? Uh, no, you just did. Nijon. I thought it was Nijon. No, I thought, I thought it was Nijon. I thought it was Nijon. Anyway. I, we'll find out next week, I'm sure. Sorry. <laughs> London. <laughs> Tayana. Courtney. Who's Dale Earnhardt's ex. And she's also, I believe, the plus size model. Yes. Isabella. Jessica. A normal name. And Sandra. Another normal name. So the girls head over to the Upper East Side of Manhattan. Mm -hmm. To the Empire State Building. And there they meet 
Nigel Barker. Oh. <laughs> and Paulina Portskova. Right. And they're waiting there with the keys to the girls' flat, mm -hmm. which is so, not flat at all. It was pretty they, hot. They gave the key to Celia. Mm -hmm. So they were like, oh, key girl, you get to choose the first right. bed. So unfortunately, there's only 12 beds and there's 13 girls. Mm -hmm. So somebody's going to have to share or sleep on the floor. So key girl did not choose her bed until all the beds were chosen. So she said, uh, yeah, I'm going to take Sandra's bed. And Sandra was like, Because that's the bed I want. But there's only 12. Yeah, so Jesus Girl London decides that she's going to sleep on the floor and let Sandra have her bed because she's all about the Jesus. So it's time for the first runway show. Mm -hmm. It's for designer Laura Poretsky. Yes. I hope that's her name anyway. I'm pretty sure. So Miss J opened the show. Was he incredibly fabulous or what? He always is. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. And I, my husband pointed out that he is like 6'5". Yeah, I totally forgot that he oh. was that tall. He's a tall drink of water. So, strobe lights and epilepsy do not mix. Yeah, um, Isabella was a little bit preoccupied with that. Because, yeah, because you know. it definitely could bring on a seizure. So, a little notable thing from the runway show... Sandra, you go to the end of the runway, <laughs> turn around, and go back. She went halfway. Halfway don't count. And then she got off, and she's like, oh my god, I did so good. Yeah, <laughs> she had no idea. She thought that you only go halfway. Maybe that's what they do where she comes from. I don't know. So, we're going to be working on the photo shoot now. <laughs> you know, so, it's in the park. I believe it was, like, Central Park. It was. And Tyra's all obsessed with girls growing up too fast. So she wants the girls that aren't grown up to play childhood games. Yes, which was really, really weird. And in the background, there were three other models. Um, Extras. Who were supposed to be girls who had grown up too fast. Right, so they were kind of snotty and bitchy and mean. Well, one was, like, pregnant. Right, drinking alcohol. I and, what yeah, I, I don't know what they were doing, but I think this idea was crap, Tyra. I, I really do. I think it had a good meaning because I do agree with her, but... Yeah, I agree too, but I think the whole photo shoot of that was just pretty much crap. <laughs> and the judges for this season, I guess, are going to be Nigel, Ms. J, Paulina's back, no more Twiggy. And of course, Tyra. And I just got to know... Ms. J, what was with the Mo haircut? I was kind of feeling it. I was not feeling it at all. It was awful so to me. So, yeah, the best picture from this photo shoot is going to be displayed as digital art in the house mm -hmm. for the entire week, I guess, or however yeah. long it is in real time. So the best picture was Allison. Miss Googly Eyes. Mm -hmm. That girl's got something, you know? I She's got to learn how to work it, though. Yeah, she's definitely got something, though. I think she'd be big in Japan. So, up next was Faux. I'm a really big Faux fan. I think she's I really I am, cool. too. I love her personality, and I do love her freckles a lot. She's got a really cute look. Then, Tayana. Then, London. Then, Celia. Then, Nijan. Then, Courtney. Who's Dale Earnhardt's ex. <laughs> Natalie. Uh, Amina. Talia, or Talia. I'm pretty sure it's Talia. Okay. I don't know. Um, you never can tell. Jessica. Because we know Tyra's history with pronouncing names correctly. <laughs> uh, did you say Jessica? I believe I did. Well, then that means it comes down to Isabella and Sandra. Oh, I wanted Sandra to go so bad. But you knew that she bad. was. She's a bad girl. She's got to stay around at least until a few more episodes anyway. So Isabella needs a lot of practice. Yeah. And Sandra, her runway was really bad. She only went halfway. And <laughs> her photo wasn't great either. Her photo was crap too. So I'm pretty sure, I was pretty sure that Sandra was going home, but then I remembered the Tyra, Tyra formula you of... You got the bad attitude. You got to keep that. That's right, because she's got to try and reform her. Break them down. Back up. Just be nice, or F you, Sandra. <laughs> so, uh, Nigel Barker, will you please sit still? <laughs> so 
so next week, <coughs> there's going to be some unhappy makeovers. You didn't even say what. We did, but we didn't. <laughs> yeah, we did, but we didn't. Isabella was sent home, which right. was kind of upsetting, because I really wanted to see how she would do. Yeah, and I really wanted to see Sandra out of there, but what can you do? It's Tyra's show. So next week, unhappy makeovers, as usual. The girl freaking pulled away right before the guy was going to cut her hair. I know. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and Sandra strikes again. Use your imagination. Till next week, much love. love.